News. You, you look at the kid, you look at your kids and how could anybody ever do this? How could anybody ever want to want to do this? April is Child Abuse Prevention Month. All month, Scotty's House is hosting blue ribbon ceremonies across the Brazos Valley to bring awareness to the issue and victims impacted in this community. But one organization says a slowdown in cases during COVID doesn't mean kids are safe from harm. Tracy Kalanog fostered and later adopted two young boys. And over the years, she has witnessed firsthand the impact of child abuse. It shapes the way they think, the way they uh, are do things physically, uh, just emotionally. It really does stick with them and uh, impact them for the rest of their lives. Community leaders look to take this month to encourage community members to be the eyes and ears to help protect children from abuse and neglect. Child abuse uh, involves some of our most vulnerable, and that's our children. So we as a, as a law enforcement agency, the District Attorney's Office, Scotty South, we all collaborate together to, to try and make a difference. Since 1995, Scotty's House has been able to help nearly 10,000 children who are victims from neglect and abuse. But during the pandemic, they witnessed a decrease in reports. It was concerning because we knew that child abuse had not just slowed down. It was that there was no one to notice that there was something wrong with these children um, or a person that that child could feel safe to tell that something was happening to them. Although Kalanog's sons carry the trauma of their abuse, her eldest takes this month as a chance to also educate his friends of the importance. Every April, he does try and remind his uh, friends about it and, you know, tries to do something a little special. Um, well, and he'll even like want to drive by the pinwheels and just say a little prayer.